at last, 200 years in the making, in honor of the bicentennial of the state of Illinois, it's the HFK Bicentennial Minute. Today in Illinois history, May 30th, 1933, Sally Rand debuted the Fan Dance at Chicago's World's Fair. Former silent film starlet Sally Rand first dazzled spectators at the Century of Progress Exposition with her world-famous fan dance on this day. During the Depression in 1932, Rand was commissioned to perform her risque fan dance with her naked body scarcely concealed by two large pink ostrich feathers. The Streets of Paris, as her act was called, landed Rand in court after Mayor Edward Kelly was offended by the dance at the fair. Superior Judge Joseph P. David threw out the, case, the charges of lewd, lascivious, and degrading to the public morals charge, saying, There is no harm and certainly no injury to public morals when the human body is exposed. Some people would probably want to put pants on a horse. When I go to the fair, I go to see the exhibits and perhaps to enjoy a little beer. As far as I'm concerned, all these charges are just a lot of old stuff to me. Case dismissed for want of equity. Rand continued to dance, took her act on the road, and was soon making $3,000 a week in the midst of the Great Depression. Today's Illinois fact. When former Blackhawk hockey player Stan Makita retired from hockey, he became the director of golf at Kemper Lakes near Long Grove, Illinois. Born in Illinois on this day, clarinetist Benny Goodman in Chicago. And that's your HFK Bicentennial Minute.